local weather authority, always watching and tracking for you from the JES Weather Center. 547 this morning, lots of beautiful shots across the area, both before and after our summertime storms. This one from Wayne and Floyd, really getting up close on that rainbow there after one of those summer storms. Now, got a few showers right on the Smith and Washington County line. That's also moving into the western half of Grayson County as we speak. Notice also a couple stray showers just north of Interstate 64 in Allegheny County. Back up the view, though, and you see this area of low pressure around the Great Lakes attached to that is a front that's going to help to trigger a few more of these hit or miss showers and thunderstorms. Now, again, you see a few of those this morning, but between about noon and six, your best chance for any kind of scattered storms is going to be along and to the east of the Blue Ridge Parkway. Not going to be as wet as we were yesterday, but as this front finally sags south, we'll turn hotter heading into tomorrow and we'll mostly stay dry. So for today, high temperatures across the board, mostly 81 to 86. The exception, of course, is some of those higher elevations. Tomorrow, however, we're well into the 80s. In fact, Roanoke Lynchburg south side tomorrow is probably your warmest day in roughly two weeks. Now, as we head deeper into the week, another storm system is going to ride that front that I was just showing you. So what that means is that storm chances will gradually start to increase heading into Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Again, kind of a typical summer pattern, but could be dealing with some areas of localized flooding by then. But none of this is necessarily tropical. We've only made it to the sea storm, Colin, whereas the past two years have been much more active. At this point last year, we had Henri in 2020, which was a record year. We had more Marco already, so thankfully not quite as active, but still we haven't even reached peak season just yet. Nothing immediately forming. So again, some good news out there for the New River Valley. High temperatures about 80 to 82 for the next several days. Maybe a stray shower Wednesday, a couple late storms Thursday, and then Friday, Saturday, Sunday is when the pattern starts to turn a little stormier for us. Roanoke Valley high temperatures well into the 80s. So this week warmer than last week. We'll watch for a few scattered storms for high school football and also for Wing Fest Saturday. That starts at noon at Dr. Pepper Park. Park. Temperatures in the middle top or 70s, highs in the low to mid 80s. But again, we'll watch for some of those scattered afternoon storms as humidity levels start to pick up. Heading later this week and into the weekend, make sure you have our app downloaded for today's scattered storms and for whatever we expect later this week and into the weekend.